let's take a look at this product it's made by William Optics it is a two inch to inch and a quarter rotolock eyepiece adapter and this particular one is in red they make a gold version also I bought this from Agena Astro products this is the William Optics number F dash R O T O dash A2 dash 125 R D now a buddy of mine from Cleveland Chuck he uh, alerted me uh, sent me an email and said that uh, he was gonna buy this I looked I said you know that's kind of interesting it was only fifty dollars I thought well let me give it a try and see how I like it so this is what your typical adapter would look like inch and a quarter to two inch something on the order like this and um, obviously your inch and a quarter eyepieces would go in here so the William Optics adapter would go in just like this and then anytime you would put an eyepiece in here instead of turning a thumb screw like this you would rotate this red dial here So let's take a look at this. It is threaded for your standard filters. And what I like about it is that instead of just being a solid ring with it like this, it has these cutouts so that you can get in there with your thumb and fingers and, and turn this and it turns very smooth very nice and here we see a standard two inch filter screws on butter smooth no issues see how this thing is constructed I'm gonna take the locking knob off as you can see there is some grease on those threaded portions close-up of the threads on the retaining ring the locking ring Now we see that on the inside, I'll try to pull this out. This is what makes the like compression, the compression ring that when you push, when you turn this down in here, this is uh, tapered. So that would push down on this taper and close down on your eyepiece and this is made out of aluminum it's not any plastic junk that is aluminum so as you can see here there's a taper at the very point here you see that taper that's on that you also have a taper inside here uh, right there there's a taper and so that when you turn that down rotate that locking dial that's what then will take this and squeeze it together and capture your eyepiece 
So here's an inch and a quarter eyepiece. If we take that collet type ring and put it on there, you see it easily slides on. When those tapers mate to each other as you rotate that uh, locking ring down, squeezes that, captures the eyepiece in the adapter. When I tighten it down, it locks on. So that's how that works. Let's dig a little deeper here. I'm going to pull this out like this. So you know we had the first compression ring here. Then you have a solid ring with tapers on both sides. See the taper there and the taper there. And then inside we have another, if I can pull that out, we have another collet type on the bottom side, just like we had on the top side. So this is actually using two of these compression rings to lock onto your eyepiece with this solid piece between them. So let me see. So you'd actually have something just like this. Two compression rings that are pushing down onto your eyepiece. So let's take a look at that solid ring. There's the taper and the taper on the other side that'll capture that collet and compress it. So basically this is what you have holding your eyepieces into that adapter. So let's try this uh, with my Teleview 3.5 millimeter Delos. We'll stick that in there like that. And we'll just tighten down the ring. And let's see. That's on there. And it didn't even take much of a turn. Next, guys, we're going to give this a try with my Teleview 40 millimeter Plasso. Next, a Teleview 10 millimeter radian. And then a Teleview 18.2 millimeter delight. This does a great job of holding eyepieces. And that adapter works well with your two inch diagonals. In fact, I was so happy with this one, I ordered another one and I'm going to eventually be putting these as standard on all of my telescopes.